Today we're here at Sowers Alternative High School and we are meeting with Dr. Harold Fry. Dr. Fry facilitates a music foundation on behalf of one of his sons who has passed away. It's called Music for Jeremy's Cherubs. His son was a music major at Baker University. He was going to be a music teacher. Unfortunately, he had a brain tumor and passed away before he could start his first year of teaching music to students. And Dr. Fry and his family, in his honor, have created this music foundation. We thought it was important to carry on what he dreamed, and that was that kids have access to music. So with this load that I brought today for your music therapy program, we're around 3,200 instruments. Some of the things I brought today are reconditioned. They were donated and we rehab them. Trombones, trumpets that I brought today. But most of the things I brought today are for, purposely for music therapy, like 24 castanets and rain sticks and tambourines and some snare drums. I didn't have any snare drums, so I had to had to purchase those. The musical instruments are going to be donated to the school and then the teacher is going to use them in an instructional material type capacity so they're going to use them in the class. But what that will mean is uh, increased opportunities to use a variety of musical instruments, things that are of high interest to our students that for sure uh, we know that they'll enjoy using. Of course with the music program want to increase their uh, understanding of the music instrument, the engagement of it but also uh, to enjoy using those tools uh, that we're providing. And we don't ever ask for them back. We hope that if the, and we kind of help the school take ownership of them, although they are, we don't allow rent to be charged, but uh, if the child doesn't want to continue, then we like to get the instrument on to somebody else. We send instruments to Guatemala, Haiti, South Africa, New Orleans, twice after New Orleans had uh, Katrina, we sent the trailer down there and it parked on a street in New Orleans and uh, repaired over 300 instruments for free. We've sent instruments to uh, Denver and then we've done about 500 guitars with traumatically injured soldiers at Bethesda, Fort Hood, Fort Carson, Colorado. So that's been one of the good things that spun off of what we do with, with uh, children. I've worked with Dr. Fry uh, as in uh, school district administration, so I, I know him. He had uh, reached out to us and uh, we have our music program here at Sowers and saw that there was a potential need and so we identified some musical instruments that could be considered to be donated, uh, reached out to him and he's been able to uh, locate those and he's bringing them down to donate to us. It's nice to spread the word because we don't spend anything on administration, we don't spend anything at all on uh, advertising, so it's all word of mouth.